these were the fields that Rena worked in. Rena and Danka worked in. And we can see over there the famous entrance. So we've just walked from Auschwitz 1 to Auschwitz 2, which is also Birkenau. Auschwitz is a different town than where Birkenau was. And um, it is over three kilometers. Our feet are really, really aching right now. Um, I cannot believe that Rina and Danko used to do this uh, in the mornings and then in the afternoons, back and forth across the fields, working 10 hours of hard labor and then standing at roll call. Uh, you know, <laughs> God, they were strong women. Um, in 1990, Rina came to Auschwitz and Auschwitz won. She came back home to Poland and went to Tillage and um, saw her old friend Franja, who she had grown up with, the only person left from Tillage that she still knew. Everybody else um, was either Jewish and gone, uh, dead or emigrated to Israel. Erna Drenger and Fela Drenger and Dina, uh, they all were in, um, emigrated elsewhere. Angie was dead. Franja was still there. And then uh, Rina went from Tillage with her husband, Jan, and they came to Auschwitz when Rina wanted to come to Birkenau and uh, collapsed. She couldn't do it. And went back to the hotel and said to her husband, uh, take me home. And they changed their flights and they fled Poland. Um, and she loved Poland, so it must have been incredibly uh, traumatic for her to um, to come back here and uh, there is a photograph of her uh, standing underneath our bite muck fry and uh, looking very diminutive and sad and overwhelmed by the enormity of what she went through and that she was back there, here uh, and probably that she had also survived she went back to block 10 she stood in front of the execution wall where uh, she had watched people be murdered and she had never been able to stand in front of it um, and then uh, and then she left so uh, coming here today to Birkenau is um, it would have been really important for her I, I, I know she wanted um, us to come back here um, and uh, and bless this place because uh, it needs blessing. It's really bleak and horrible. <laughs>